Hello. <laughs> so I am here with Olivia and we are going to do another try on haul video. Another bestie rates my outfit because honestly, I had so much fun with you and then people in the comments were telling me they had so much fun with us. And it makes total sense because Olivia is really coolio. When you're a millennial, you start with AOL. You had AIM, which is AOL Instant Messenger. And Olivia was always so cool. Like I was begging to be her friend when we were in middle school. And I asked her what her AIM was. And she said, Hangout Girl. And I was so confused because I was like, I don't understand. She's so cool. And that's such a dorky <laughs> username. Like it literally sounded like something I would have, like not know how uncool it was. I had a company called Blooming Jelly reach out to me and they're like, oh, we have some workout clothes. We want you to do a try on haul. And I was like, that's great. But I want to get free for Olivia too, because she loves workout clothes. You kind of live your life in leggings, which doesn't make sense right now but yeah. it's true like I see you in leggings all the time we don't know if these will fit we looked at the size chart we tried our best but this is a way yeah. to give you an honest review of blooming jelly try on the clothes and then see if you vibe with them knowing that they could look similar on you yeah so one bag is yours one bag is mine I couldn't help it I already looked at all the clothes <laughs> like I had to pick them out so so you, I don't know, I think enough time has gone by like you don't remember. So. No <laughs> oh wait, I'm already in the frame. Oh, here I come. Okay, three, two, one. Oh, yours looks so good. See, mine look like boxer shorts. You're, they're just way too big. These were like pretty small though. Are, is yours high waisted or no? I'm not. I'm not making them high waisted. See, like they made Ugh. them. I don't know. I feel like this kind of. No. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like gym, like old, like middle school gym shorts. But it's like too baggy and like. Yeah. Wait, hey, what if I tuck it in? Or does that look dorky? It's kind of cute. It's not like is cuter. It? But the no, it does not. The thing is though, like I was kind of worried about these. I know they're in style, but it was like Nike shorts that fit like this. But I personally like something that sculpts the booty. But like some people aren't comfortable with that. Yeah. Like they actually don't want people looking at them like that. They want something that's just breezy. Yeah. And I think that works in that sense. It's okay, just, wait, it's I just feel like too too fluffy on the sides. It just doesn't doesn't the frame like it's too much for yeah it doesn't like shape yeah. you enough for me would i roll it down see i think yours are so cute i think it works for me for some reason and then just to show you the features well okay i rolled it down you can't see but there are zipper pockets yeah. on the side is there a pocket in here too um, no i don't think so i think it's just is it on both sides one side okay let's see how much room there is Okay, that's enough for an ID and a key, but it's not wide enough for a phone. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> I do like too though it, that it has a built-in underwear. Yeah. So that again, that's a good perk, like depending on what you're doing in the gym. Yeah. Okay. Okay, what about them rolled down though? They are kind of tight. I wonder if like long term if they'd feel fine. I mean, I get pretty bloated. So it's like me too. <laughs> so it's like ugh, I already kind of feel it pressing a little bit, but maybe it's okay. Like it's kind of, maybe it's just like snug and not too much, you know. Personally, would you add those to your wardrobe as of now? Yeah, because I okay. I've been into built-in bras and built-in underwear. Recently. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Like um, I have this you don't have to worry about sports anything. bra and the pads are sewn in. Mm -hmm. And like, look how busty I look. So will I keep this in my wardrobe? I will wear it. I will keep track of every compliment I get. And if I don't get enough, it's going on my Poshmark. Okay, <laughs> Okay. now we gotta try our biker shorts. Woo! Woo! Okay, three, two, one. 
Hey, those are cute. Do you like them? Yeah. They have, um, some people don't care, but they have like an inseam in the front. Yeah. Okay, I don't like mine all that much. Huh. The thing that makes it hard is like, I don't think they fit me perfectly, but I'm wondering who they're gonna fit. Be because like, it's a little baggy down here. They're baggy down here, but they're really tight right here. Yeah. It feels like they need to just rethink the sizing on this. The dimensions, yeah. Because the look of it's neat. It's definitely the type of fabric where you, you can feel it. I don't think you'd work in work out in That's this, so right? That's so soft. But would you work out in it? I feel like it's kind of that cozier fabric yeah. that you would do with an outfit. Like Jaclyn Hill does a really good job with doing a baggy t-shirt and biker shorts. So like, yeah. maybe if they upgraded the biker shorts. Does the booty look cute? Yeah. It does? It does. Okay. Like so it. there's just a little feedback there, but I kind of want to look at yours. I feel like yours is workout. Yeah, mine's up on oh, workout. Oh, yeah. And it's ventilated. Yeah, ventilated. Oh, here, you should show them. I like it. So it's not a V cut, but they kind of have a double line. Um, you do have a line down here, which again, it's all preference. And then yeah. you have like seams that go right here. Yeah. Feels good, and it doesn't like, like I know I can if something's even hugging just like a little bit around my mm -hmm. thigh here, like my extra fat right here kind of flows over a little bit, but it doesn't feel too tight right there. I deal with roll up, and then you do you do too, right? Yeah. Oh my, is that like something that's just inevitable? Like yeah, I don't, yeah, like because they're longer though, they kind of hold. Yeah. Hold it perfect. They look good on you. Like I've been getting into biking recently. It's it's a smidge tight. Oh my gosh, the umbrella. With <laughs> I get yeah. a tummy ache if it if it goes around my tummy. I get a tummy ache <laughs> if it goes around my tummy, but like for a long time. Like I'll never forget like wearing certain pants in school, getting my period, and then Ugh. hours in the classroom just being Awful. miserable and gassy yeah. and I was like oh God. yeah like for me because mine are so tight I think they're tight enough that probably within the hour they're gonna hurt mm. so I really hope they like listen and they upgrade yeah that. I, mean, so, sometimes like, you, like, I don't think I'm gonna add this to my wardrobe but if they updated it yes I'd be down yeah I think I would add you would add yours yeah okay I think that's fair. Yeah, yeah. they look cute on you. Because sometimes like the, a tight waistband, either like it starts hurting or you just kind of like get used to it and it doesn't really matter. Yeah, and it helps too because some girls like a big band that sucks you in. Let's see the leggings. Here I go. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, because I'm backing up. Do you want to call it? Yeah. Three, two, one. <laughs> Ooh, oh, that's cute. I love those. Do you really? Oh my gosh. Yeah. Honestly, I feel like this kind of saves the try-on haul for me because the other ones, I just, I wasn't feeling it. But those the material so is really soft. And then yeah. you have a kind of a thick enough waistband where it does hug you. Yeah. But nothing feels restricting. Like 10 out of 10, I am going to add this to my wardrobe. Yeah. So if you're like petite shopping on Blooming Jelly and you're like, I don't really know. Um, trust me, like I feel you, like I don't really know, but I can at least tell you the leggings. How does it look for the booty though? Like with the, is there a good enough contour? Like, is it, is it flat? Is it straight? It's flat, yeah, it's a straight Okay, it's thing. a straight. So if you're someone that only feels secure with a V cut, I don't know the leopard is so cute you might just want to compromise it there really <laughs> yeah. yeah let me see yours because bloomy and jelly for their 2020 workout collection they didn't have a lot of v-cut leggings so i kind of want to do a 360 with you okay. dun 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 ooh, ooh. Oh. Ooh, you know what though like i mean olivia never needs a v-cut you know like <laughs> olivia's always rocking it i like it I like the little zipper back here, like that. Yeah, it feels it feels very like I don't. You feel, feel comfy? Yeah, I feel comfy. Don't feel restricted. I like the I like the color, like the gray color. Like yeah, the, the breathable stuff back here. The so one much. thing is that I kind of feel like it could give you a little bit more of a booty lift, mm. and I don't know if it has to do with the illusion of the V cut. Like the booty looks good. 
but you know how there's certain spandexes it's like how they stow it yeah you almost feel like it pulls it up yeah I kind of wish it did more of that and okay. to the I have no advice for that because I don't I'm not a seamstress you are have a seam again down the booty do you have it down the front yes you no, look so cute though thank you I just really want you to know that I know I noticed that like here if you have bigger legs like me like I noticed the I don't know what to call it I, I don't have a cellulite or just like I don't know just body yeah. Um, where you people can... do kind of give it the is it cellulite proof okay. that's a phrase that people yeah. well, use I don't want to say I'm all for showing cellulite whatever I don't it doesn't matter but like if you care yeah. I have bigger legs and I have some cell cellulite back here and it looks like you can see some of that through here to me it doesn't look like cellulite to me it looks like the aftermath of kind of pushing down on your booty this way mm -hmm. your fatty part which is your booty is like pushed yeah, it's creating the visual more of that. Yeah. <laughs> this is a very long in-depth review. <laughs> but um, I do, though, like, I look at you and it's like, that's cute in the front. That's cute in the back. Like, I do. Cool. Yeah. I don't like, um, my eye doesn't go to a specific part. So, did I ask you this? Would you add this to your wardrobe? Yeah. Yeah, I would. On the catwalk. <laughs> I'm somebody that I get overheated when I work out. So I don't work out in leggings. Mm. I barely work out. But I don't work out in leggings anyway. But to me, this is something I want to walk out the door as an outfit. I like how their um, pieces are like functional and simple. But I think, yeah, there could be a bit more attention to detail as far as like women who want to maybe like shape their booties more. Their option range was good but not great because there's a lot of girls who are not even going to look at certain workout pieces if they don't have the right contour lines and the V yeah. cut. And I think it would help um, be a good one-stop shop if they were to take all that type of feedback. And then second, I know sizing didn't fully work out for me, but I think if they were to invest in getting more models and putting their stats online, yeah. then you know, it's fine if not everything looks good on me. That's just life with all different body tape types. At least you're feeling more confident in your purchase. Yeah. And then you just need that one good first experience and then you got return shoppers. But I think it was really awesome that Blooming Jelly found me, reached out to me, and they were totally cool with making this a bigger try on haul to include my yeah. bestie, Olivia. Thank and so you. for that, we thank you. And any other brands that want to work with us, this video is so high quality, who doesn't? <laughs> so just hit yes, me yes, hit yes. me up and I can bring Olivia back all the way from Austin. So, <laughs> yeah. you know, give us the hookup. Um, thank you so much for watching. And I guess I will see you in the next video. I love you. I love you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what am I supposed to say? She means it. Oh. I love you. She means it. <laughs> Bye, guys. Thought I was going to do this and you're going to pretend to be slapped. Get out, get out. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. Okay, bye. Oh, gosh. I was on top of my toes the whole uh. time. Oh.